Welcome. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, ladies and gentlemen. Happy Halloween. Whatever is happening. Hey, you Pisces. It's Halloween. It's the last week of October. And for you Pisces, I'm calling in on the angels and guides. For the Pisces, uh, um, universal angels and guides, come in and show the Pisces. Pisces, your water in this um, week is an air week. Pisces, be careful out there in this week, whatever is happening. It's Halloween. It's kind of weird. You can really manifest and ask for what you want on the 31st. So be aware. Be aware, Pisces. Um, Pisces, some of you, if you have a child that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I'm seeing this child coming up in this week. Whatever is happening with this child, I'm seeing this child coming up in this week. So there's definitely something. There is a, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Uh, some of you could have have a child that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. I'm seeing this child coming up or maybe some of you are trying to get in touch with this person this person could be a relative a friend but i'm seeing the energy of a young woman that is a taurus virgo or capricorn between the age of 18 and 45 is coming up okay so let's put her back and see what is happening if the, you were asking a question when i was shuffling the cards um it is a taurus virgo or a capricorn okay so if you were asking a question who is that who is that person or whatever it is a young taurus virgo and a capricorn between the ages of 18 and 45. so the monthly readings are up um you can also um um use the link below to check out your monthly readings so you pisces Four of Cups is here, whatever is happening. I see some of you Pisces have some regrets, okay? So the Four of Cups is here. I'm seeing some of you Pisces. Um, it can be regrets, but it can also be that you're planning for a new start, okay? You're planning for a new start. You are deciding to make some changes in your life in this week, you Pisces, okay? You need to stand your ground, stand your ground against certain issues and situation that is happening. Stand your ground. I'm seeing, um, especially at work, you need to stand your ground. Uh, news is going to be coming in. So if some of you were waiting for some news, some of you are planning and some of you could be wondering why you haven't heard from someone or news, it's going to be coming in. Then we have communication. There was silence for a while, but now communications is coming up that is going to give you um, a, a new start going further. The energy of justice is in the reverse. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, you need to stand your ground, you Pisces, okay? Whatever that was happening and transpiring, you need to stand your grounds. Whatever that was transpiring with your child, if your child was an Aquarius, Leo, or Sagittarius, I'm seeing this person is in reverse. So I'm seeing that some of you were waiting and wanted to find out what was happening. The energy of the tower is here for this person. Whoever this young person is, is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. So whatever that was transpiring and is happening is an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. Now I'm seeing the energy of um there's justice coming up um against um a pisces cancer or a scorpion you young people be aware of what is happening because i'm seeing communication um you young people i'm seeing you communication you had some regrets so some of you want a new start and you're waiting for a message i'm seeing a tower moment and i'm seeing um um uh, you know balance in balance and you need to stand your ground you're saddened by what you have heard some of you were waiting on some news um this news isn't uh, coming in um news about an aries Leo or sagittarius um i'm seeing the energy of uh, um a man 45 years and older is in the reverse whatever this issue is i'm seeing you were open to hear some news from a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man, I'm seeing this in the reverse form and the tower moment beside that. It is not a good week to make any decision, you Pisces. Whatever decision you need to make, it's not a good week. This is the last week. 
not a good week to make any decision you pisces so you pisces especially you young people between the age of 18 and 45 not a good week to make any decision communication is going to be the key what i'm seeing here is that you pisces need to stand your ground some of you were hoping that a legal issue is resolved i'm seeing sadness with a legal issue and uh, um whatever the sadness is uh, i'm seeing this coming up it could be sadness with a libran um um so you men could be having sadness um you young men between the age of 18 and 45 could have sadness with a legal issue i'm seeing news coming in where the tower moment come down for a virgo a, a gemini whoever this gemini is and whatever your energies are all in the reverse you gotta pay attention in this week okay so what do we have here we have some information unexpected information is coming in so some of you pisces are going to be receiving some unexpected information whatever this information is it has to make information that you guys were waiting from and hoping that some resolution with a legal it's not going to go in your favor pisces okay so i'm seeing that some of you wanted a new start but you um need to stand your ground with a situation and communicate with a legal issue protection you need to protect yourself this is the nine of uh, ones you need to protect yourself whatever is happening you have the energy of the nine of ones you need to protect yourself in a legal situation whatever is transpiring you need to protect yourself in a legal situation as we look forward some of you were hoping to hear something from um your it could be your wife this is a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn person but i'm seeing a new start i'm seeing communication between you and this person i'm seeing the energy of the tower for an aries leo or sagittarius whatever this person has done against this um lady she um whoever this aries leo or sagittarius is there's a tower moment that happened last week so whatever is transpiring now you're standing straight this person news is going to come out for this person this person whoever she is whether it's your wife your partner or whoever she is going to be receiving some good news the truth came out about what has transpired and it has to do with you um young pisces between the age of 18 and 45 there the the truth came out uh, and this woman stand strong the truth came out about this woman some of you have regrets and this woman stand strong whatever the deceptiveness was and whatever that has occurred now you have regrets about something that you did some of you have a project some of you are working on a project and uh, some of you could be working on a project with a taurus virgo or capricorn this could be your father or a father figure or your boss but i'm seeing um you're working on this project whatever it is but it's as if it's not delivering what you had expected you're working 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 on a project but it's not delivering what you should what you expected don't give up i'm seeing um the truth came out last week so whatever transpired the truth came out about a project or some work you were doing do not make any decision this week pisces i'm seeing that some of you are dealing with a taurus virgo or a capricorn person this person is standing up very strong um however way some of you could be dealing um with a, a virgo but you haven't heard anything from this virgo you were open for some news from this virgo man but you haven't heard anything this could be a father figure an older person 45 years and older i'm seeing that um a situation as a um some information came out the week before and you were hoping to hear from this person whatever but you haven't heard from this so there is some sadness but some of you should stand your ground and protect yourself at the same time and i'm seeing whoever has done some deceptiveness against a taurus virgo or a capricorn woman i'm seeing this person it could be that you're in a relationship with a taurus virgo or a capricorn woman and this person has a daughter that is an aries leo or sagittarius whatever is happening or whoever this person was or is i'm seeing that this person has a tower moment where whatever injustice that was done 
against a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman and seeing news is coming out there is a situation some deceptive situation at play some of you feel regrets what has happened to this woman then we have the father of cups so you men 45 years and older is in the reverse form you men want a new start um you men are thinking about the past you want a new start um there is some regrets here some of you men could be receiving some information and could be having a new start you need to protect yourself what we have here is another nine so something is going to be ending in the lives of you guys whatever is ending let it go the second energy of number nine comes up um but it's kind of weird but the second energy of number nine comes up okay and this is the nine the nine yeah this is the nine this is the nine of ones that is a nine of swords this is the nine of ones so you have the nine of ones and the nine of swords there's a lot of worry with a legal issue whatever is transpiring i'm seeing some of you pisces have a lot of worry with a legal issue if you had a legal issue and the outcomes i'm seeing the energy of the two of cups i am seeing happiness and joy if you're in a relationship with a man that is a taurus virgo or a capricorn i'm seeing that you're connecting with this man whoever this man is you're really connecting with this man i am seeing a lot of information coming out for you guys some of you were hoping to hear something about a project or see um a project go in a direction that you wanted it's not coming up but don't give up hope hope okay it's as if this week because it's the week of justice is really balancing out situations and things so don't give up hope whoever is a taurus virgo or capricorn i'm seeing you're hoping to hear and wishing to hear some news from this person some of you are so saddened about something because you're finding out the truth what has happened and transpire and what an aries leo or sagittarius person have done but um you want to um communicate and you know and say i'm so sorry but i'm seeing this person turn their backs on you I, and this lady whoever this lady is um this is a taurus virgo or capricorn and whoever this lady is she knew that uh, um people were deceptive around her and i'm seeing she move in and relocate she had relocate and you haven't heard anything and you're hoping to connect with her and said shit I've, now i've found out and now i've known what is happening i'm seeing a lot of you are going to be connecting with a taurus virgo or capricorn man and whatever that is happening i'm seeing you connecting with this person whatever issues and situation is going on i'm seeing you connecting with this person so pisces it's really a week because i'm seeing a lot of you pisces worried about a legal issue because some information came out you're very worried especially men 45 years and older i am seeing you in the reverse whatever that has transpired happened i'm seeing you in the reverse and you are so sorry about something that has transpired and happened number 21 is here so if you were born on number 21 the fields of dreams so if your birthday fall on 21 the fields of dreams this is going to be a good week for you because a lot of new opportunities is going to be coming up you're going to be having a lot of um partners coming up this is going to be a wonderful week for the people who were born number 21 so if your birthday falls on the 21st of uh, um february um where the 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 the, the 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 um pisces begin you are going to be very lucky because i'm seeing a lot of new doors are going to be opening for you you're going to be working with a taurus virgo or capricorn man and this is going to be good ladies and gentlemen i want to wish you a wonderful week and i'm saying namaste until next time